All right. Good morning. Today it's just the wife and I, Amy, and we brought bagels. And I'm gonna show you the new motor. Oh, this is a slip, by the way. It's not too huge. In fact, it's pretty small. Uh, we just pulled it in, and that was horrifying in itself. So uh, hopefully, we'll be able to pull out and pull back in. Let's see. So after screwing around with our old motor time and time and time and time and time and time again, we decided we're sick of possibly breaking down, uh, cleaning out the car, changing fuel, and we decided to get a new motor. This one is a Tohatsu 6 horsepower ultra long shaft Sailmaster, and it starts right up. All right, that was pretty easy. Once I remember to connect the fuel, we were ready to shove off. And here's us leaving the little slip. And oh uh, man, it is stressful. I'll tell you what. but we're making like six knots. It's pretty awesome. Doing good. So we made our way all the way to the mouth of the St. Lucie River, right? Yes. Where um, it kind of splits off and goes inland farther. And uh, we are 
averaging about six knots, so that's pretty good. We're doing pretty good. I think six knots isn't bad. Um, the wind's coming in big gusts, so we keep leaning way over, and then, uh, like right now, I think it's gonna happen again. Let's see. Let's see if I can catch it. Catch the wind a little bit. We rode past Sandpiper Bay. Yeah, Sandpiper Bay. <laughs> Here we are. This is where our slip is. There's a sunken boat right over here. We'll uh, walk over the dock and show you later. It's pretty cool. Well, it's very sad actually, but it's just, it's interesting. This marina is actually for sale, so um, yeah, they need some TLC. But it's cheap, it's pretty cool. It's very convenient, so can't complain. What up, boat? right up past this thing right in here which is tight and quite terrible I wish we were closer because we have to squeeze in even more and it's pretty horrifying but uh we're learning the next weekend we decided to take the whole family out including the dogs and we went under the bridges one of these bridges services the local railroad, and the other one services a little bit of traffic that goes in between Jensen and Stewart. The problem is you got to catch them at the right time. Uh, I think these open on quarter hours, and we missed it on the way back. Alright, that's all this time. Hopefully we'll have some more adventures for you soon, but life has been really hectic. Uh, if you just stick with me, um, I'm investing in you know a million dollar rig here pretty soon. Uh, super high tech, ultra 3D graphics and everything. Plus we're going to get drones, helicopters, quadcopters, uh, you know, you name it, we'll have it. Anyway, we'll see you next time and thanks for sticking around. Bye.